The Cotabato Basin, nestled in the southern Philippines holds the promise of abundant oil and natural gas reserves. This geological treasure chest spans over 10,000 square kilometers. Could this basin be the key to the Philippines' energy independence? Early estimates suggest vast reserves lying dormant beneath the surface. Only time and extensive exploration will reveal the true extent of Cotabato's energy wealth. The Philippine Department of Energy is particularly interested in the Cotabato Basin. Their studies point towards significant deposits of both oil and natural gas. Some estimates place the basin's potential reserves on par with other major Southeast Asian oil and gas fields. If these projections hold true, the Cotabato Basin could be a game-changer for the Philippines' energy landscape. The story of oil and gas exploration in the Cotabato Basin is not a new one. As early as the 1960s, whispers of the region's potential began to circulate. These whispers turned into exploratory drilling attempts, with companies eager to tap into what they believed was a vast reservoir of hydrocarbons. While these early endeavors yielded some promising results, they ultimately fell short of uncovering commercially viable reserves. The technology of the time, combined with the complex geology of the basin, posed significant hurdles for these early explorers. Extracting oil and gas from deep beneath the Earth's surface requires advanced equipment and expertise. Back then, these resources were not as readily available and the challenges proved too great to overcome. However, the data gathered during these initial explorations laid the groundwork for future endeavors. Despite the setbacks, the dream of harnessing Cotabato's energy potential never truly faded. Geologists and energy experts continued to study the region, refining their understanding of its complex geological formations. They knew that beneath the surface lay the potential to transform the Philippines' energy landscape. It was only a matter of time before technology caught up with ambition. These early explorations, though ultimately unsuccessful, served as a valuable learning experience. They highlighted the need for advanced technology, a deeper understanding of the basin's geology, and a more collaborative approach between stakeholders. The stage was set for a new era of exploration, one driven by modern technology and a renewed determination to unlock Cotabato's energy secrets. The year 2023 marked a turning point for the Cotabato Basin. After decades of speculation and anticipation, modern exploration finally commenced. Leading the charge was SK Liguasan Oil and Gas Corporation, a company specifically established to unlock the basin's energy potential. This marked the beginning of a new chapter, one fueled by advanced technology and a renewed sense of optimism. Unlike their predecessors, SK Liguasan came equipped with cutting-edge technology and a wealth of data gathered over decades of research. This time, they were determined to succeed where others had faltered. Their arrival in the Cotabato Basin signaled a renewed commitment to exploring the region's energy potential. The start of modern exploration was met with a mix of excitement and apprehension. Locals, eager for the economic benefits that oil and gas production could bring, watched with anticipation. Environmental groups, however, voiced concerns about the potential impact on the region's delicate ecosystem. The government, keenly aware of the high stakes involved, pledged to ensure responsible and sustainable development. The commencement of drilling was not merely a technical achievement, it represented a leap of faith. It was a testament to the belief in Cotabato's potential and the commitment to overcoming past challenges. The world watched with bated breath as SK Liguasan embarked on its mission to unlock the energy treasures hidden beneath the basin's depths. Section 4, Fueling the Dream Investments in International Collaboration The exploration and potential development of the Cotabato Basin is no small feat. It requires substantial financial investment and expertise, attracting the attention of international players to the project. SK Liguasan Oil and Gas Corporation, while leading the charge, recognized the need for collaboration. They secured significant investments from foreign companies, bringing not only financial backing but also invaluable technical expertise. The influx of foreign investment underscores the global significance of the Cotabato Basin. Companies from China, Australia and the United States have all shown keen interest in the project, recognizing its potential to reshape the regional energy landscape. This collaboration brings together the best minds and technologies, increasing the likelihood of success. However, the involvement of foreign entities also raises questions about ownership, resource sharing, 
and potential environmental impacts. The Philippine government has been adamant about maintaining sovereignty over its resources, ensuring that any development benefits the nation and its people first and foremost. The financial investments and international partnerships are crucial for the project's success, but they also necessitate careful management. Balancing economic interests with environmental protection and national sovereignty is paramount. The Cotabato Basin Project represents a complex interplay of local aspirations and global forces requiring careful navigation to ensure a prosperous and sustainable future for all stakeholders. Section 5. Guardians of the Basin Government Oversight and Regulation The exploration and potential exploitation of the Cotabato Basin's resources fall under the watchful eye of the Philippine government. Multiple agencies are involved, each playing a crucial role in ensuring responsible and sustainable development. The Department of Energy, or DOE, takes the lead, overseeing all aspects of the project, from exploration licenses to environmental impact assessments. The DOE works in close coordination with other government bodies including the Department of Environment and Natural Resources, or DEN-ER, and the National Commission on Indigenous Peoples, or NCIP. The DEN-AR ensures that all activities comply with environmental regulations, safeguarding the region's delicate ecosystem. The NCIP, meanwhile, protects the rights and interests of indigenous communities residing within the basin area. This multi-agency approach reflects the government's commitment to a balanced and inclusive development strategy. They recognize that the Cotabato Basin Project is not just about extracting resources, it's about ensuring that such activities benefit all Filipinos while safeguarding the environment for future generations. The government's role extends beyond regulation and oversight. They are also responsible for creating a conducive investment climate, providing incentives to attract foreign companies while ensuring fair revenue sharing agreements. The Cotabato Basin Project is a test case for the Philippines' ability to manage its natural resources responsibly and leverage them for long-term economic growth. Section 6. A Double-Edged Sword. Opportunities and Challenges. The prospect of oil and gas production in the Cotabato Basin presents a double-edged sword for the Philippines. On the one hand, it offers tremendous opportunities for economic growth, energy independence and job creation. On the other hand, it raises concerns about potential environmental damage, social disruption, and conflict risks. The potential benefits are undeniable. The revenue generated from oil and gas sales could fuel economic development, improve infrastructure, and enhance social services. It could reduce the Philippines' dependence on energy imports, stabilizing energy prices, and bolstering national security. Moreover, the project is expected to create thousands of jobs, revitalizing local economies and providing new opportunities for Filipino workers. However, these potential benefits come with inherent risks. Oil and gas exploration and production can have detrimental impacts on the environment, particularly in ecologically sensitive areas like the Cotabato Basin. Oil spills, habitat destruction, and greenhouse gas emissions are all legitimate concerns that need to be addressed proactively. Furthermore, the influx of workers and economic activity could disrupt local communities, potentially exacerbating existing social tensions. The presence of valuable resources also raises the risk of conflict, particularly in a region with a history of insurgency. Managing these challenges effectively is crucial for ensuring that the Cotabato Basin Project benefits all stakeholders and does not come at the expense of the environment or social cohesion. Section 7. Mapping the Future Project Timeline and Milestones The Cotabato Basin Project is a long-term endeavor spanning several years with various milestones. The project is divided into exploration, appraisal, development, and production phases. Currently, the exploration phase involves seismic surveys and drilling to confirm viable reserves. Upon discovery, the project moves to the appraisal phase for detailed assessments. If positive, it transitions to the development phase, constructing infrastructure for extraction and processing. Finally, the production phase begins, marking the start of commercial extraction. If you found this video informative, please subscribe to our channel, like the video, and share it with your friends. Your support helps us bring you more insightful content.